The effortless stride and elusive grace belong to Walter Payton, the latest in a vintage line of Chicago Bear game breakers. A list that includes such football immortals as Red Grange, Beatty Feathers, George McAfee, Willie Gallimore, and most recently, Gail Sayers, the man to whom Payton is most often compared. Like Sayers, Payton inspires and leads by example. He's the driving force behind Chicago's return to contention, the heartbeat of this young club, with all the natural gifts to earn himself a niche in the Hall of Fame. He didn't score on this 75-yard burst against Detroit, but he did score on two other occasions, and his 160 yards rushing helped Chicago control the football most of the afternoon. Against Detroit, the Bears got the kind of individual performances necessary to win crucial games, such as Steve Schubert's little stop-and-go maneuver against Detroit's punt coverage team. Seventy-three yards later, the Bears were well on their way to a big Central Division victory. Many football analysts have picked this team to unseat the Minnesota Vikings as Central Division champions. But the Vikings say they fear the Lions more than the Bears. Perhaps it's time they had a change of heart.